Hey, hey, Virgo. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Blue Phoenix. Thank you so much for coming to the channel today. Virgo, I'm here to do a love reading for you guys. All right, so I'm going to try to make this a real quick love reading. Look at there. A message of love right there to start your reading off, okay? <laughs> Look at that. All right. Wow. And then the Four of Swords, that's rest, that's dreams, possibly, okay? Wow, and then, look, love reading, and then the Ace of Cups right up under that, a gift of new love. So let's see what's going on, Virgo. Um, let's see, let's get on one accord first. If you are new here, if this message resonates with you, please do not hesitate to subscribe. Become a part of the BEF gang, yeah, <laughs> the big energy family gang. <laughs> That's hilarious. Anyway, but uh, yeah, if you feel led to, I would definitely appreciate it. And it helps your girl grow her channel. Look at this. So whoever I'm talking to here today, a Pisces might be significant, okay? Um, but this is the energy of knowing it. I heard know it all is what I heard as well. But of intuition and knowing the unknown. Also, I heard secrets, okay, Virgo? I'm hearing secret. I heard secret partnership, okay? I don't... I don't know what that means, okay, yet. We'll find out. All right, I'm going to just keep this here for a second and see what Spirit want to tell me about that. All right. Also, do not forget to like the video, all right? That really, really helps me out, and that's a dope-ass way to exchange some positive energies with one another. All right, Virgo? Now, let me tell you what's going on here real quick before we get on one accord. Um, this is what came out in pre-shuffle, and we'll talk about it in a minute, and I'm going to also tell you about your cards, all right? All right, so Holy Spirit, Ancestor Spirit, guys, tap in, what's up, what's up? <laughs> Thank you so much for this opportunity, Holy Spirit, for me to tap in with the Virgo Collective. I ask that you help me see what I need to see, hear what I need to hear, and get that message back to the Virgo Collective in a way where they can understand it and utilize it for the betterment of their lives, okay? Thank you, thank you, thank you to my Ancestor Spirit, guides, Archangels, Orishas, and all divine beings of the highest level lightest light for the messages direction and protection y'all provide me each and every day archangel michael i ask that you go before me and protect me as i channel these energies and read these messages okay all right i thank you ashe amen so mode it be so mode it be all right what is this oh empress energy <coughs> this is taurus libra energy excuse me yeah so you have two feminine, big feminine energies out here, okay? This is a mothering energy. This is a leader of her family. Wow, judgment on the bottom. Someone being judged here, okay? Or a, I'm, I'm hearing a calling or a recognize, a rec recognition? What the hell? Like you recognize something. Something's brought to light or something, okay? Look at that, the hermit, I'm telling you. Yeah, something was brought to light. But let's do this the correct way, okay? Let me tell you what's up. First of all, the... I, I rolled y'all's dice and the number nine came out. Okay, that's the ninth house. Or that's what I was thinking of, which is Sagittarius. Sagittarius is ruled by Jupiter. I'm thinking big, okay? Or something big. I heard of, but like, I, I don't know. I heard a big bone too. I don't know what that is. Okay, or what that necessarily might mean. Okay, and it's talking about a mumu. Okay, I don't know. Maybe somebody is overweight or something. Or somebody's mom is overweight or you are. I don't know. All right, but anyway... Um, a Sagittarius may be significant or some kind of balance I'm hearing, okay? I hear, I keep hearing something about a mom figure, though. Something about a mom. All right, okay, and all right. So with this card, it says, it speaks about travel, foreign affairs, culture. You know, Sagittarius are the wonders of the tarot i mean of the tarot of the uh, of astrology okay of the constellations he's okay and some about okay so in the cupid's arrow cupid's arrow okay all right so yeah you got the nine of wands here this is fire energy aries sagittarius leo okay all right so right here it looks like in the past energy um you virgo were in the, some sort of relationship that was a burden to you some burdensome relationship okay i feel like there was an ending to this relationship or there was supposed to be an ending to this relationship virgo okay so tell me more about this 10 of uh, -uh. look at that seven oh wow whoa all right so seven of cups the queen of swords eight of swords and the page of cups i'm feeling like 
an illusion. You broke out of an illusion. You discerned your ass up out of a, some kind of bondage, some kind of an illusion or something. And this was burdensome on you, okay? Whatever this was, this past energy in love, okay? In love, all right? Now, your present... Oh, look, yeah, okay, so that was... You brought an ending to it, okay? Like I said, or either you were supposed to. 515 was on the clock. You might want to look that number up. All right, so now right here you have the Two of Swords, the two of swords speaks of to me this is like decision making right but blind decision all right they're pulling me to your planet virgo virgo your planet is governed i mean is um is mercury oh my gosh a little net so i'm hearing okay wait i'm hearing something about okay and then it turned over this eye this is the um evil eye repellent you know what i'm saying like this is for people who wish bad upon you you know what i'm saying you reflect that energy back to them this evil i reflects that energy back and it was a net over here that i just flicked away so i'm feeling like monitoring energies for some reason so maybe someone from your past you may have completed a cycle with is monitoring you when i say that i mean like on i, I was gonna say on tv <laughs> i don't know so maybe some of y'all are like uh, uh, i don't know on tv or on the media or something in the media or something okay oh yeah because this could be the internet A City of Nightmares featuring Tragic Hero by Alex Faith is on right now. He says something about nightmares that just made me turn around. I'm like, what the heck is he talking about? But anyway, all right, so it's, Mercury is the planet of communication, okay? And in the sixth house, that's the planet that is ruled. You know what I'm saying? That y'all rule, Virgo. Wow, tower energy tower energy okay let me tell you on this two of swords all right this blind decision wow and this may be coming fast for some of you guys all right this is a blind decision to me this is like okay i have to make a decision this also oh, i'm hearing something about the high priestess again okay pisces energy scorpio very watery energy around you or something like that is what i'm feeling all right look karmic cycle on the bottom of this deck over here yeah no uh-uh it's i'm hearing all right some about a cycle all right all right. Anyway, let's get to this tower. What is this tower for the for the um, energy, present energy and love for Virgo, please? What is this tower under this blind decision? Okay, what is this tower for Virgo, please? Spirit ancestor. Wow, bro. Yo, eyes being open. I told you some kind of clarity you're gonna receive. This tower is unexpected. You're gonna be like, wow. This is going to cause you to, I heard build up your fences, but I was going to say defend yourself, right? But mend a fence, I heard too. And then this person with these with these wands is making me feel like he's going to go and like build something. I don't know, building something is what I'm hearing. What is this? What is this tower? What is that? Three of cups. Wow. Maybe a third party with something. Whoa. Look at that. More discernment. Using your discernment, okay? And I told y'all that Sagittarius energy poking out right there. That temperance. That's balance, okay? And then you have the world here again. Something you brought a completion to, okay? Wow, look. Something you walked away from or you will be walking away from. Because this is present energy. I'm hearing you may receive a message from a third party, Okay? Wow, look at this shit, okay? A message from a third party, right? Which is gonna be the ending in a walking away of something, from something. What is this about, Spirit? What are they walking away from, please? What is this that Virgo needs to walk away from, please, Spirit? Okay, present energy and love. What is this that Virgo needs to walk away from, Spirit, please? All right, what is this? They tell me to look on the bottom. Wow, a karmic fucking psycho. I'm telling you. Okay, and then look. Repeat, look at this shit. Up under that, robots, repeat, monotony. Okay, you got to walk away from this, Virgo. That's what I'm hearing. Yeah, this karmic psycho. Thank you, spirit. All right, so tell me. All right, yeah. He said trying to live can't be too cautious. Somebody trying to close his coffin or some shit. I'm telling you, balance. Balance is what I'm I'm okay. All right. They're talking about this. Um you is some something you're gonna how do I say it? You're going to 
stand your ground. Like, you gotta stand up for yourself, okay? In some kind of way or something. Like, you... All right, how do I say this? It's gonna create... You're gonna create boundaries. Yes, this is a lesson is what I'm hearing. This is a lesson. Yes, this is the truth. What I'm saying, I'm telling you. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> this experience that you're having in love right now is going to propel you, is what I'm hearing, into um uh the next level is what i'm hearing okay it's like it is preparing you for the next stage of love okay or like i don't know i, I don't know what yeah something like that all right yeah all right in this karmic cycle so spirit what can virgo look forward to in the future in love please look at that justice i'm telling you and the truth i'm telling you justice and the truth is is is, is that's it the Ace of Swords speaks of truth. This is what you, this is the energy surrounding what's coming to you in the future. Justice and the truth, baby. Do you hear me? Yes, Virgo. That's surrounding energies. What is this about, Spirit? Wow, Blessed Up is on right now by Wanda. She said, I've been blessed up. Wow. Wow, what's the future energies coming towards Virgo and love? Please, spirit, ancestor, spirit, guys. They say turn over the last card. Wow, look at that. Didn't we start with that? Four of swords. Rest, baby. Yes. <laughs> Rest. Jesse. Somebody's name might be Jesse. All right. Um, look at that. Aries energy, new beginnings. Okay, that's the fool. You understand me? Look at that, the fool starting over but this is a good thing is what i'm hearing virgo yes truth and justice okay what else spirit for future energies coming towards oh wow okay let me let you know now look 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 all right let me just tell you somebody may somebody you girl guy listen now Somebody is, is, okay, that's a love offer from somebody you walked away from, okay? Be aware of this. A love offer from someone you walked away from. What about this love offer, Spirit? Jeez Louise. Oh, Lord. It might be from a Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Pisces is really strong. Virgo, Aries. <clears throat> all right, those are the energies right here. All right, I'm not going into all of those. There's way too many. Look at that, though. Two of Cups. The Mini Lovers card. A Gemini may be specific, specific. Illusions. Yeah. Somebody's going to come back with an illusion like they have gone and done some introspection. I'm hearing no, no, no. This might be a King of Cups, okay? A father figure or something like that. Okay. Yeah. Somebody, he might, they might, she or he may overindulge in something is what I'm hearing. All right. Yeah. Okay. What is this though? What you saying? Okay. Yeah, this person finds you very, very attractive. Like, I don't know if they, if you're on in a public eye of some sort or something, um, or some, or social media or something like that. I don't know. All right, spirit. What's what's up with this message? Or okay, for some of you guys, a King of Pentacles may be significant. Capricorn, wow, Devil on the bottom of the deck. Thirteen thirty one was on the clock just then when I looked at the clock. That is mirroring energy, okay? This is like that kind of twin flame-ish, you know, or soul, soul, or soul partner, but soulmate type of energy. Yeah, somebody's watching you, okay? Yeah, somebody's really watching you, bro. A king of pentacles is watching you, okay? All right, so, yeah, I don't know. This does. This may not be the same energy I felt before, okay? Hold on. What is this? This feels new. What is this, spirit? This feels new, um, Virgo. What is... What? Yeah, the devil is 